Okay, hey guys. Um, today I'm going to show you how to convert the enchantment table to English, quote unquote, because the quotes are because uh, it doesn't make any sense at all when you convert it. It's basically like looking at this random crap. It'll say words and stuff, but they lead nowhere. <laughs> like, it'll say random words and they won't s mean anything at all. So, yeah. <laughs> but if you still want to do it and see if I'm a total liar or not, um, uh, let's get right into it then. Okay, so what we're basically are going to do is convert these A, B, C, D's, A, B, C's into these uh, standard galactic alphabet um, letters and what's not. So yes, or uh, hieroglyphics, whatever. Anyway, let's go and convert it. So I'm gonna close that because I already did this video. Except I realized that it was um, recording at a very fast frame rate. It captured a frame like every five thousand milliseconds or something, which. Yeah, the video was over in like five seconds and I was just beginning. So, um, anyway, enough complaining about what happened earlier. Let's go to the start menu and go down here into your little search bar and type run. After that, go to percent app data percent, just type that in and press enter. Now you should be taken to your uh, username, app data, roaming uh, file. Um, that is, if you're on Windows. If you're not on Windows. <laughs> Let's go down to the .minecraft folder, open that right up, um, go to the bin folder right here, open that up as well, and you should see all these jar files, all these different files here, and a nati natives folder. Uh, I think this is 1.2.5, version 1.2.5, so yeah, in the future, I'm not sure if you'll be able to follow this, but probably I mean it doesn't change that much every time um, so yeah just uh, click double click on that minecraft file right there and it will probably take you to this window if if you already have it so that when you opens it up automatically then you just have to double click on it if not uh, it'll take you to this window where you should click on when to open it. If you don't have WinRAR, I will include a link in the description so that you can obtain it and it's not actually free. Um, you'll see in a second, I will press OK right there. I press OK and it came up full screen for some reason and it says right here, please note that WinRAR is not free software. After a 40 day trial period, you must either buy a license or remove it from your computer. Which is hilarious because they don't restrict your use of it. You can just exit this and continue. It's kind of stupid on their part. But anyway. So you're taken into... Let me go back. Come on. Alright. So you are taken into this little uh, uh, file thing here. You should have all these files right here and all of these class files down here. You don't need to do anything with these class files, but go into your font folder right here. Open that up and you should see two at the very top that are called alternate 
and default. What you want to do is you want to drag these to your desktop. I already did this, so it's going to tell me that these are right here. But I'm just going to say move, but keep both file, keep both files. Oh shit. <laughs> Basically what you want to do is you want to name your alternate one, rename that, rename it alternate backup, and then rename your default one, rename that one alternate, and then keep this alternate backup one uh, on your desktop or put it into some folder where you won't delete it and you actually know where it is, don't hide it from yourself, because that's kind of stupid, but anyway, um, go back into your dot jar and simply drag your alternate file right here drag that into there and make the update node add and replace files because you want to replace it so you press ok and it should have replaced your alternate file now um, I was also getting a lot of questions on what are these right here well, um, Minecraft has a an option. Option. <laughs> wow, I've been cracked in frickin' forever. Great timing. Great timing. Anyway, um, these files basically have the uh, characters for other languages because you can change your language in Minecraft and it will change it to these. Um, it'll use these files to get those characters. So do not touch these. Do not touch these files or else you would get an error most likely. You will most likely get an error if you delete all these. Do not touch. No touchy. Okay? So keep those the way they are. And all you have to do is replace that alternate file. You can put your backup file into here if you need to, or if you want to, so you don't forget where you put it. Um, so yeah, simply close out of this file so that you can open up Minecraft. I'm pretty sure if it's open, you won't be able to open up Minecraft. But anyway, let's open up Minecraft. Run. <laughs> Go to single player. This was my last test world. I will delete it. Create a new world. Make it creative mode so that you don't have to hunt down all the items to make a crafting bench. Or you can just go into your world that you already have your crafting bench for. Because if you're watching this, you probably already have a cra crafting bench. Or crafting. Or <laughs> enchanting table. I was typing and trying to talk at the same time. Anyway. Uh, I'm going to name mine test world and I'm going to create a new world and it's going to take a long time to make the work Okay, hey guys, I'm back um, I know my cursor is floating over the little thing even though I can't see it It's floating floating over it for you guys. Let's uh, take off here. Oh yeah, I forgot my computer's a piece of crap. Anyway. I want to enchant to the top of that mountain because I'm cool like that. Apparently the computer gods don't want me to do that. Am I flying? No, I'm not flying. Ah, shit. Anyway. I have a crafting bench in my inventory. Let me just place it down here. <sighs> Poop. I'm not going to be cool today because I can't go to the top of the mountain. Okay, get out of the crafting bench and get out the bottle of oh, enchanting so that we can actually chant something worthwhile. Now. 
Sadly, there's no guy around. Loads of e Loads of XP. Okay. Nah. Particles are trying to attack me. Okay. Now let's place down our crafting bench. And let's take out a diamond sword. <gasps> Not the diamond sword. Okay. So take out the diamond sword. Take out the diamond sword. Let's take out like three of them so I can prove that what it says has nothing to do with what it's actually going to do. And it, all right. So click on it. Put it in there. Shrink the stale. Undead dry creature. Nictu galvanize self. Okay. Let's see what shrink the stale does. Sharpness one. That makes no sense at all. Okay. Another diamond sword. Put it in there. Spirit embiggen curse barata. Animal humanoid fire. Imbue earth curse undead. What is this one? Imbue earth curse undead. Holy balls. Holy balls. Sharpness one, fire aspect one, and f knockback one. Um, Elder Enchant Self Earth. Nictu Demon Bless Bless. Water Beast Destroy. Water Beast Destroy. That just sounds awesome. Sharpness 1. Okay. There you go. Proof that you can actually change it to English. Or kind of English. English words, not English sentences. So, um,. No, oh, of course it flies now. And that it makes absolutely no sense as to what the enchantment actually gives you. So I'm going to fly away. Actually, let's make the outro me killing shit. That's not going to be possible. I'm all alone in this world. <laughs> no one to kill. Oh, hey. Thanks not loading for telling me that's a cave down there. Come on. <gasps> Sheep. Okay. Uh, see you guys. Uh, thanks for watching. Please rate, comment, and subscribe if you liked it. Um, otherwise, you can just you know leave. Not give me. Maybe you could favorite if you really liked it. That would make that give me smiles upon my faces. So yeah, uh, thanks for watching. So yeah, I'm gonna just go kill some sheep. Well, I guess can go to another video.